Ben iki de değil miyim? After the first match, Ezaj Basri has the advantage, but it is not over until the second game finishes. How do you evaluate today's game? I think we have to be focused all the time for for like uh, trying to to be more precise, to be patient because they are pretty good team and we just want to fight and do our best. So we will see what happens, but we want to fight. How was their preparations uh, during the last week? Yeah, we, we prepared pr pretty well, but we have also our our league games, so we have to be focused also uh, of them. So uh, I think it was good. So we we will see what happened, but I think I'm uh, I think it will be a really good fight. So yeah. Okay, thank you. Good luck.
We are live inside the TV of Burhan Felix Sport Hall in Istanbul for the second quarterfinal match in the CEV Women's Champions League. It's in Zasebashe, Dinovit Istanbul, at home to developers Zhezhov. Hello everybody, I'm Michael Chivello. We should be in for an absolute treat of skill, drama and action this evening. It's Zasebashe coming off a 3-1 win away in their first quarterfinal. They lost the first set, then powered back to win the next three. Leading the charge, Tiana Boscovic, who has scored 74 points in 11 sets in this Champions League campaign. Russian Irina Voronkova has scored 62 points in 20 sets. And Croatian international Samantha Fabris, who has 59 points in 13 sets, but did not play in the first quarterfinal leg. Edzatsibashe have traditionally fared well against Polish opposition. They've lost only one of their 15 Champions League matches against Polish opponents. That was a defeat to Chemic Police in the group stage back in 2015. Zhezhov will turn as always to their star Georgian and Kalandadze, who has managed a whopping 135 points through 33 sets, including 77 side outs. Gabriela Orbasova has nailed 127 points in 31 sets, including 85 side outs. In the first quarter final at home, Veronika Chentka top scored for Zhezhov with 15 points. As we see the introductions of the players for Etsatsubashi receiving a fabulous ovation from the home audience. So much will rely on Tiana Boscovic, as I mentioned earlier on, and Irina Voronkova, the towering Russian. Zhezhov will need, as always, the leadership and drive of Yelena Blagojevic. The 33-year-old Olympic bronze medalist has been with the team since 2017. Blagojevic scored 23 points in Rezhov's 
Polish Super Cup win last November and won the match MVP. We see the lineups here. Once again, so many eyes on Boscovic, on Voronkova, on Yasmin Juveli. After a powerful first quarter final win away at Sadzabashi, are the overwhelming fan favourites to win today, with 88% of polled fans tipping the Turkish team to progress to the semi final stage. Voronkova tipped as the top scorer with 89% of fans. There you see Stefan Antiga, Zhezhov's French coach, who knows how to achieve results. He steered the Polish men's national team to a world title in 2014, fifth place at the Rio Olympics in 2016. And we are off and running in this second quarter final between Zhezhov and Edsatsabashi. The home team playing in the white. The away team, Zhezhov in the blue. Early point on the scoreboard for Zhezhov. Katarina Venerska to serve. Goes down the centre, picked up by the Libero. There's the spike. It was a solid hit from the left side. Free ball there for Zhezhov. Down the centre, block works well. Trying for placement on that hit. And there's sheer power. Libero did well to meet it. An enormous roar from this home crowd who have really filled in this arena tonight for this all-important second quarter final. Zhezhov as Venerska stays on serve. The 29-year-old with eight aces coming in tonight. Another point for Zhezhov. So the Polish team getting a jump out of the gate here in Turkey. A 3-0 lead keeps Katarzyna Vineska on serve. And that was a shocker. Just floated that one into the net without any sort of accentuation on it from Vineska, which now puts Etsatsabashi into rotation through their Russian star Voronkova. Served down the centre from Voronkova, ultimately goes long. And that allows Zhezhov back into rotation. Not the start that Irina Voronkova was hoping for. Did have six aces so far coming into this campaign. And here is the lady whom so much relies upon for Zhezhov and Kalandadze, their Georgian superstar. Sends it down the six. A power spike from the right-hand side ultimately goes long. And this is a fabulous start for Zhezhov. They go 4-1 ahead. Yasmin Guveli's spike, not one of her 25 winning spikes she enters this campaign with. Kalandadze, a lovely ace. Powers it into the one. Sixth best server in the Champions League so far, Anne Kalandadze. And she shows why there with her 14th ace of this campaign. Power server gain. Beautifully done from Zhezhov. They've taken quite a controlling lead early here. Wonderfully placed. From Magdalena Jurshik. 28 winning spikes coming in tonight for Jurshik. Good hit from the left side. Libro did well to pick it. And the block works on that occasion. Second point for Etsatsabashi. Beautifully done from Yasmin Guveli. She had 11 kill blocks coming in tonight. There's number 12 for her record in this Champions League campaign. A big hit from the right side. 
That one from Gabriella Orbasova. She is such a threat, Orbasova. The 22-year-old Czech. That's her 111th winning spike of this campaign. The serve goes long. Allows the third point on the board for Etzantabashi. And it will be their superstar, Tiana Boscovic. The Olympic silver and bronze medalist. Silver in Rio, bronze in Tokyo. Set to the left side, just trying to tip it into the hole there. Beautifully saved. Ball still in play here. That is wonderful from Itatsubashi. And a power strike from the right hand from Gabriela Orbasova. Wonderful work from Orbasova. Look at her get into position here. Beautiful set. And Orbasova powers it into the six. You can see why Orbasova comes in tonight as the seventh best spiker in the Champions League campaign so far. As Edzatabashi just stay within reach of Zhezhov. They trail now by five points. With Hande Baladin on serve. The national team player. Under 23 World Championship gold medalist in 2017 Baladin. But ultimately, a poor serve from her. Zhezhov losing the first quarter final. 3-1 at home. Would love to reverse that. It is possible tonight. From behind the attack line, a power spike indeed. And Satsubashi through Tiana Boscovic. Bring the deficit back to five points now. And this is Sinead Jack. The 29-year-old middle blocker on serve for Tatsubashi. Set to the left side. The block couldn't deal with it. And it's 11-5 now for Zhezhov. Puts them in rotation. This is wonderful work. That allows Anna Obiata to get on serve here. Not a deep serve from Obiata. And Zhezhov in command of this opening set. It is not the start that it's Antabashi wanted here. Obiala missing that one. The 27 year old middle blocker now puts Antabashi back into rotation. It is Maya Ogninovic. Serves to the five. Ball still stays in play here. Up goes the blocking wall. And a lovely spike down the right-hand side there from Gabriela Orbasova. From behind the attack line. Orbasova just rises like a rocket through a vertical tunnel. Beautiful block. That is lovely from Zhezhov. And once again, it's Gabriela Orvisova. 16 kill blocks coming in tonight for Orvisova. She adds to that impressive tally. A timeout called. 14-6 for Zhezhov. Not the start at Satsabashi wanted. Right, 
try to use the setter and Blagojevic when she's in front. Girls, many times they play seven and over to zone one. Okay, so when you see corner, middle player goes seven, do not be late with Orvo Savana. Go earlier, she goes nine. Nice. There is a sense of confidence from Stefan Antiga, the French coach of Zhezhov. It is Kartazina Venerska on serve for Zhezhov, the 29-year-old setter. Spike from the middle. It works for Atzatzabashi. High fives there to Yasmin Guveli. You see Guveli set herself beautifully here off the right arm. And it's wonderful work from the opposite who came in with 11 kill blocks and 25 winning spikes tonight. Good serve deep. Set to the centre. The block works well. Yasmin Guveli again. Doing some good work. Irina Voronikova. But look at this beautifully placed there from Itzatsubashi. Really making an imprint, although they are trailing so far, is Yasmin Guveli for Itzatsubashi. Fans worldwide, of course, heavily tipping Itzatsubashi to go through to the semi final stage. And was there a block touch here? Did it just touch that left arm of the blocker? They trail by seven, the home team, Edsatsabashi Istanbul. And this indeed is Irina Vronkova. The Russian having landed six aces in the campaign so far. What a superstar she is. And so much of what Edsatsabashi do relies on Vronkova's form. Cannot rely on services like that, though. She went down the centre. A little too much power without the placement. And it puts Zhezhov back in rotation. From one superstar to another, Kalan Dudze. Power served from her into the six. Hit from the right side. Ball kept in play. Solid strike. That is wonderfully done from Hande Baladin. This could have been a troublesome ball for Itzatabashi. And Baladin did well. Still that seven-point deficit for Tatsubashi. Lovely spike. Well, if ever there was a definition of a kill shot, that was it. Set to the left side for Jurchik to deal with. And she dealt with it effectively. Here she is, Magdalene Jurchik. Serves it into the six. Sinead Jack. Trying to win the point there for Itzatabashi. Beautifully done. They found the hole on that occasion, Zhezhov. And this really is a lightning start from the Polish team. A huge gaping crater in the center of the Itzatabashi court. And it was found by Zhezhov. Jack. Set to the left side. Powerfully done, Tiana Boscovic. The Serbian who actually began her sports career in karate until she discovered she was too tall for a life in martial arts. Found her way into volleyball. We're glad she did. 
Nice pick up. And there's the hit from Gabriela Orvisova. Seventh best spiker in the campaign so far, the 22-year-old Czech. And you see an example of why right there. Sinead Jack. The 29-year-old middle blocker. Pitching that one sweetly from the right side, dashing across to the two. My word, she got some height on that, did Jack. Hande Baladin on serve for Edzatsabashi. Tip over, works well. Zhezhov maintain a nine point lead. Required some delicacy. And indeed, that's what it was met with from Yelena Blagojevic, their captain. On serve now. Sinead Jack launches herself the block. Goes out. Nice work from Sinead, Sinead Jack to play the block out. But it's Atsabashi with a big deficit to overcome here. Eight points in it for the away team leading. Jack off and Urkek is on. The Turkish national team member, Yaprak Urkek. Running the pipe, but ultimately the ball going out. Good start for... Yaprak Urkek. It was Orvisova. Hitting down the pipe there for Zhezhov. Little tip over. Free ball for Itzatsabashi. Thunderous strike picked up well. Libro keeps it in. Tip over. Free ball for Itzatsabashi. Wonderfully done. What a rally. The block. The ball's still in play. Oh, a kick. Just goes wide. It could have been spectacular. A superb rally. And Atatsubashi stay within a sniff of Zhezhov in this first set. Stefan Antiga having some issues but this was so nominal from behind the attack line running the pipe a hit from the left side oh lovely save that was wonderful for Voronkova and Tatsubashi Worked hard for that point. Wonderful leap from Tiana Boscovich. The two-time world championship gold medalist in 2018 and 2022. Tiana Boscovich. Okay. Let's go. We got it. High point advantage. We are playing a really good. Just a stereo point. Let's go. Come on, come on. It was at one time a nine-point lead for Zhezhov. It has been cut down to five points. Stefan Antiga trying to keep his charges leveled. Reminding them that they are playing well. They have come out firing in this first set. They are almost home to secure it. Can Itzatsubashi rally? Kalan Dadze. Beautifully done. They can rally indeed. Tiana Boscovic. She is such a powerhouse. 
Boscovic from behind the attack line. 66 winning spikes in this campaign coming in tonight, and she adds to that. Lovely save. Dug that well. And it's a beautiful hit from Voronkova. Keeping Itzatsubashi in this race for the first set. They've narrowed the margin to three points. It required some delicacy on the touch from the block. And it certainly got that treatment. Four-point lead again for Zhezhov. Sinead Jack comes back in. Yaprak goes off for Itzatsubashi. The blocking wall goes up and once again does its job. A superb opening set here. That one actually into the net from Boscovich, who was not pleased with herself. Another timeout. Now, a very precarious situation for this team at Satsabashi. Sorry about this, okay? Try to use. Try to use the corridor 6-1, Irina, if you have the ball, as much as possible. If the work from zone 1 doesn't go well, we can play also 5. Okay, hi, let's go. Former Turkish national team coach Ferhat Akbar in his second season with Etsatsabashi. He won the Champions League with Vakif Bank as assistant coach back in 2013. How he'd love to go all the way as head coach this season with Itzatsubashi. Can they rally back? They trail by five. Veronika Sentka. The 22-year-old middle blocker. To serve for Zhezhov. That one goes wide. It was a lovely hit from Voronkova. Boscovich is playing wonderfully on that. Right hitting side. Kalandadze. Lovely work. Yurchik putting up the block as Zhezhov are now only three points away from winning this first set. Yurchik did well to defend against Voronkova's hit. Venerska. Free ball for Zhezhov. And a power laden strike. Wonderful from Orvisova. The seventh best spiker in the campaign. Just smashing that one through the blocking wall. Venerska again. Hard for the Libero to deal with. Free ball for Zhezhov. Set to the center, little tip over. And they found the campfire. And it puts them on set point, Zhezhov. We saw a similar scenario in the first quarterfinal in Zhezhov, where the Polish team won the first set. Can they do it again? Oh 
And it's Atsubashi. Now trail by six. But that is certainly a bag full of set points for Zhezhov to have. Voronkova with the serve. Powered down the centre from Irina Voronkova. Kalandadze! But the block works its treat. And Satsubashi not waving the white flag in this opening set. Wonderfully blocked from Tiana Boscovic. And at Satsubashi are still alive. There is fight in this Turkish side. The hit from Orvasova. And a wonderful block from Guveli. The set, however, for Zhezhov, 1-0. Is history going to repeat itself, however? They did win the first set at home in the first quarterfinal. And then it's Atsubashi powered back to win 3-1. The serve ultimately going long from Voronkova. She could not afford to be giving away points like that. There is work for the home team at Zatabashi to do. They trailed by one set. They were also in a similar situation in the opening quarterfinal in Poland. But they did rally back to win 3-1. Are we going to see a similar score tonight? Could Zhezhov possibly put this into a golden set? A lot of drama unfolding here in Turkey. 
And that's a better start for Tatsubashi. Zhezhov, who came out of the gate strongly in the first set to develop their confidence. And that service miss is the type of confidence booster Itzatsubashi need at the start of this second set. Two nil now for Itzatsubashi. You see the smiles. So much relies on the emotions in this game. Emotion creates momentum. Kalandadze with placement. And she gets Zhezhov on the scoreboard in this second set. Kalandadze, who was voted the fan MVP of the pool phase in this Champions League. And the Georgian now on serve. The service goes long. And a two-point lead for Itzatsubashi. Voronkova on serve. It was her service miss that allowed Zhezhov to win the opening set. And it puts Zhezhov back in rotation. Magdalena Jurczyk. The 28-year-old middle blocker. That one out of play from the Libero. No power behind the serve, rather floated down the center into the sixth there from Jurczyk. She stays on serve, 3-2, it's Atsabashi. Again, down the center, a little more power on that one. There was a lovely hit, though, from Tiana Boscovic. The Serbian, who was MVP in the 2017 European Championships, where she averaged 7.22 points a set. Oh, well picked up. Smashing. Absolutely smashing from Hande Baladin. Gets it through the heavy traffic. And Tatsubashi serving through Guveli. the center Kalandadze with the pass and there's the hit from Anna Obiala Orbisova What a hit, laden with power from Tiana Boscovich. Leapt like a gazelle and struck it like it owed her money. Boscovich on serve. And Tatsubashi lead by two, trial by one set. Well, that one's staying in. It looked like a close call to the baseline. Protest here from Zhezhov. Will there be a challenge on it? There was a look when the ball struck the court that it had gone long. And then, of course, the chair umpire gesturing the way of Itzatsubashi. They lead by three. Boscovich on serve. Down the center. Too long, though. And now back to a two-point lead. Zhezhov in rotation. 
much closer start to this second set than the first where Zhezhov tore out of the gates. Blagojevic. Sinead Jack leaping from the right side. But Zhezhov pulling it to within one point. A lovely block there from Kalandadze. Sinead Jack. Little tip over. Ball still in play. And once again. It is Tiana Boscovic. She is a handful for anybody. And certainly proving a handful for Zhezhov in this second set. Powered it through the arms of Obiala. Zatzabashi back to a three-point lead. Kalandadzi unable to affect the hit off her right arm. Free ball there for Zatzabashi. High from the Libero. Lovely. Exquisite block. Keeps Zhezhov within two. Power here from Boscovich. And placement from Obiala. Tricky one to deal with. And the wonderful work, the block out there. Irina Voronkova just placing that one onto the hands of Venerska for the block out point. Sinead Jack. Service to the six. Kalandadze from the left side. Boscovich can't get to that one. They stayed within two points, Dujezhov. Lovely set to Kalandadze for the block out point. Nice bit of emotion from the Libero Alexandra Shudlovska. And look at this, Zhezhov to within one point of a Tatsubashi in this second set. That one goes long from Voronkova. Going cross court for Ankova. It's Azabashi, just need to steady here. The block touch is ruled negative. Can Edzatsabashi at home steady the ship? After a good lead earlier on, Zhezhov have rallied back. We have parity at 10 all. Beautiful strike from Guveli. Came in with 25 winning spikes in this campaign so far. And it does put Ogninovic on serve for Edzatsabashi. 
Maya Ogninovic down the centre. Set to the right. And once again, the leaping tongue of fire that is Boscovich. Callan Dudze receives the serve. Good block. Callan Dudze with a hit. Lovely work from the Libero with a pancake save. And Boscovich goes long. Zhezhov. Keeping on the heels of a Zatsubashi. This is a close one. Callan Dudzi with a serve. A power serve goes to the A. Down the line. Callan Dudzi. Wonderful lace. She has such a powerhouse. 13 aces coming in tonight. There's another one for her tally. The sixth best server in the Champions League this season. Not so on that occasion, though. Hands a point to Itzatabashi. My goodness, what drama here in Turkey. Voronkova. It was a hard serve. Kalandadze did well, and that is wonderful. Great reception from Callan Dunsey on the power serve. And have a look at that leap from Magdalena Yurchik. A coiled spring. 13 all. Placement. Ball stays in play. Blocking wall does well. A leap, a hit. Lovely work again from Boscovic. Left hand absolutely slapped that ball. Yasmin Guveli on serve, the opposite. Orvasova on the right hand side. Tatabashi, two points clear. Orbasova a little disappointed with herself. Yasmin serves. Good reception, though, from Blagojevic. Boscovic placement picked up well. Tip over from Blagojevic. Boscovic. Shlagovska dealed with it. And Sinead Jack. Lovely work. Wonderful block from Sinead Jack. Three points clear now at Tatsubashi. The American Izzy Rapash on. Yelena Blagojevic, not successful on that occasion. It's Atabashi, four clear now. Are we indeed going to see a repeat of the first quarter final? Going down the line was 
Blagojevic. But the captain going wide. Yelena Blagojevic in her sixth year with Zhezhov. The 34-year-old Serb. And now Stefan Antigua needs to steady his ship. Yasmin Chuveli serving for Atsatsabashi. Reception from Kalandadze. The hit from Blagojevic. Blagojevic going cross court, looking for a deep pocket to the five of Adzatsabashi. Sinead, Jack. A meteor through a vertical tunnel. Wonderfully done from her. Boscovic with the ace. Lovely serve over the head of Kalandadze. Dead centre into the six from Boscovic. Power on that hit on the right side. Four points in it. Second set. Zhezhov winning the first. The captain, Elena Blagojevic. Four aces so far in this campaign for Blagojevic. Lovely placement from her. transition pipe or zone one means that you need to focus much more Kalandatse or Obiawa okay Obiawa first the, uh, timing is the most important more than the space okay right, let's go. are they going to focus on Izzy Rapac it's all about timing can Zhezhov Power back. And Satsabashi at home. Three points clear in the second set after losing the first set. Yelena Blagojevic on serve for Zhezhov. Sinead Jack. She popped like a champagne cork. Look at this from Sinead Jack. Wonderful work down the line. Just at the feet of Shlugovska. And it puts Hande Baladin on serve for a Tatsabashi. Kalandadze with the hit. Good slay from Shlugovska. Kalandadze again. Wow. And Tatsubashi now only four points away from winning this second set. They've got to be thinking to themselves, Zhezhov. We cannot allow to happen what happened at home in the first quarterfinal. Where they won the first set, then they lost the next three. 
Was it a block touch? The ruling is it was. You saw the look on the face of Cullen Dudzik. She believed that she had won the point. And indeed, Zhezhov, three points behind now. Obiala on serve. Sinead Jack again, a power hit. She is a house on fire in this second set, Sinead Jack. Lovely work cross court. And indeed the target there was Izzy Rapash, the American, as the coach had called for. Sinead Jack off and Urkek back on. Kalandadze looking for placement. Free ball here for Itzatabashi. Good block from Kalandadze. Lovely work from her. A view of Izzy Rapash, college player with Temple University Owls. 30 winning spikes in this campaign so far for Rapash. That one tipples over the net. It's an ace. It may not have been the prettiest of aces, but still it gets the point for Zhezhov. And they nip at the heels of Adzatsabashi. And at transition, her sets are shorter. Make sure left hand, okay, zone five, do not forget for tip, okay. Kalandatse out of system balls, she waits and after goes, roll shot or long from block out. Pay attention, wait, I let's go. Very technical, strategic from the former Turkish national team coach Ferhat Akbas in his second season with Edzatabashi. Venerska on serve for Zhezhov. They trail by two, now by three. They do have the opening set in hand, Zhezhov. But once again, the nightmare of quarterfinal number one could come to fruition again. And Tatabasha now two points away from securing a set. Bogoyevich unable to deal with that reception. Finds the campfire. Ball still in play. Kalandadze. Free ball from the Libero, but the point goes the way of Atatabashi. Set point indeed. Hands thrown up from Zhezhov. As if to say, why from Blagojevic? What happened? Maya Ognjanovic on serve for the set. This crowd alive in Turkey. A free ball for Tatsubashi. Can they finish the set now? Yes, they can. Irina Baronkova. A power strike from the left side and is one set all.
Coach, uh, you made a great start to the game and it's once at all. That means the tie is still alive. How do you sum up the game so far? We are playing good. Uh, we played a really aggressive in the first set. Maybe they were a bit surprised. Uh, in the second, well, uh, <laughs> they were better. Where it was more difficult for, for us to control, control them with block and defense. So, but we are, we are ready to, to fight further. What are your plans for the rest of the game? I won't speak about any tactic in front of the camera. Okay then, good luck, thank you. We are tied at one set apiece going into the third. A 25-20 opening set through 27 minutes for Zhezhov. A 25-19 second set through 29 minutes for Itzatabashi. Stefan Antigua was interviewed between sets and he did say they were aggressive in the first set, which Itzatabashi probably didn't expect they need to find that aggression again, the Polish side.
And a good start here for Zhezhov. Just finding the hole. Jurczyk. The 28-year-old with 21 kill blocks coming in tonight. Vanerska with the serve. Hit from the right side. And you do get the feeling this will be a close set. Voronkova. Hitting beautifully. She is on serve now, the Russian. Serve down the center. And Sadzabashi. A real sense of camaraderie in this team. Lovely block work there from Hande Baladin. Power serve into the six from the Russian. And Zhezhov get their second point. The block out there. Kalandadze on serve. Down the centre. A magnificent ace from Anna Kalandadze. She is special. 13 aces coming in tonight and 110 kill spikes in nine games hitting 3.3 percent Anna Kalandadze power serve again from Kalandadze and the block working on that right side for Zhezhov Orvasova meeting it with her right hand All smiles from Anne Kaladadze. Power serve again. It's a Zabashe. Keeps within a point. Yasmin Guveli to serve. Good look there of Sinead Jack. Had a wonderful second set did Sinead Jack. Found the hole. We are drawn at four all in this third set. The middle blocker, Sinead Jack, having a standout game. 11 kill blocks coming in tonight for Sinead. And there's another lovely block from Adatsabashi off that right side. Look at the wingspan here on Sinead Jack and on Tiana Boscovich. Like two albatross. Shlagovska, the libero. The hit comes in hard from Orvisova. Gabriela Orvisova, the 22-year-old Czech, seventh best spiker in this Champions League campaign. Lovely. We are seeing a seesawing contest here. Tiana Boscovic. A power hit through the centre. No way that Cullen Dudze and Co could deal with that. The block off the hit from Orvisova. Orvisova again here. That one just going wide from Sinead Jack. Puts Zhezhov back into rotation. Actually, Sinead Jack not making contact with it.
off the net. Well dealt with by Shlagoska, but ultimately going wide. It was a lovely reception, though, from Akos, the libero, for Zatsabashi. They call her Atamand. Best libero at the 2019 European Championships. Akos out wide. Free ball for Zatsabashi. Sinead Jack, she soared like a hungry tigress. And that is a lovely kill spike. Baladin. Free ball for Itzatzabashi. Akos puts it up. And it's a lovely hit from Vorenkova. The Russian meant business on that one. Stefan Antigua's team trail by three. We are deadlocked at one set apiece after two here in the third in Turkey. Wherever you're watching CEV Champions League around the world, hope you're enjoying all the drama of this second quarter final for a chance to move through to the semi final stage. Kalan Dadze with the failed reception of the serve of Hande Baladin. Hande again. Dealt with by Shlagovska. Sinead Jack did well. The coverage here from Sinead Jack, blocking wonderfully. It's up for her now. Tip over from Jack, ball still in play. And that was a wild spike. Lovely work there from Gabriela Orvisova. Yelena Blagojevic serves down the centre. Met by Akos. Blockout point achieved by Sinead Jack. As I said earlier, having a standout game, Sinead Jack, even with the bandaging around her fingers. She's on serve now. The 29-year-old middle blocker. Shlagovska with the pass. Orbasova with the hit from the centre. That one coming off the block of Guveli. Zhezhov trail by three. Obiala serve. Free ball for Edzatsabashi. From behind the attack line, just a tip to the campfire. Lovely work. That was exquisite from Tiana Boscovich. Well, it's a split second choice, isn't it? Between power and precision. And there's the power from Orvisova. Yes. 
Lovely right side hit from Orvasova. Zhezhov in rotation. And this is Katarzyna Venerska, the 29-year-old. Shlagovska puts it up. And there's a hit from Orvasova. But it is over the line and Itzatsubashi maintain a four-point lead. And they have Irina Voronkova, the Russian, on serve. What a pedigree for Voronkova. Her father, Andre, former national coach. Her mother, also a former professional volleyball player. Itzatsubashi, five points clear. Zhezhov have to be thinking not again they won the first set at home in the first quarter final and lost the next three They need to settle the nerves here, Zhezhov. A heavily partisan crowd in Turkey have been very vocal for Atatabashi with their superstar Irina Vronkova on serve. The Russian, a power serve into the six. Orvisova. Orvisova again. And look at the smile there from Simje Sebdemakos. She really threw her body into that, didn't she, Akos? It's Atabashi, six points clear. And some signs of frustration, perhaps, on Zhezhov. They handed a point off the serve there from Voronkova. It gets the Zhezhov superstar on serve as the captain Blagojevic takes a break. And it will be Anne Kalandadze. A must-win point. Powerful from Kalandadze. There was no uncertainty about that. Kalandadze serving deep into the one. Did have 13 aces coming in tonight. Kalandadze, she has added to that total. She came in as the sixth best ranked server in the Champions League. Goes down the center again. Dealt with by Akos. Orvisova puts it up. Hit from the left side. Beautiful block. And Tatsubashi clear by five. Gouveli. All the sober with the hit. Wonderful save there from the Libero. Shlegovska. And Zhezhov closes it to within four points in this third set. Zhezhov winning the opening set 25-20, losing the second 25-19. Very important serve here for Magdalena Yershik. Akos meets it. Free ball for Zhezhov.
Akos did well. It's up for Orbisova. And there's the block. It's that woman again, Sinead Jack. She is blocking like Norton antivirus tonight. Tiana Boscovich. Two-time world championship gold medalist sends it to the middle. Well, Zhezhov bring it back to within. Four points. That one finding fingertips at the net, even though Sinead Jack protesting. So I believe there's a challenge here. Pinchiska in, Orvisova out for Zhezhov. The 20 year old setter, Pinchiska. Sinead Jack. Well done by Akos. Beautiful block. Lovely placement. Obiala. Up went Boscovich. Three woman blocking wall. Had it covered though. And frustration from Maya Ogyanovic. transition she catch the ball high and slow okay the game style change we need to adapt to it go a couple of targets pointed out there by Ferhat Akbas being Rapach and Shilagovska Seventeen fourteen, third set, one set a piece. In this second quarter final, for a right to proceed through to the semi final round. From behind the attack line, wonderfully done, running the pipe. And Tatsubashi going four points clear. Beautiful set to the pipe, and there it is from Boscovich. Sinead Jack getting up for the block once more. Lovely off the left side hit from Zhezhov to bring it back to within three points. Good look there at their libero, Alexandra Shligovska. Akos did well. Free ball for Zhezhov. Nicely played by Izzy Rapash, the American. 30 winning spike coming in tonight for Rapash. And solid work there from the number 16 outside hitter. A wonderfully delivered serve, just floated into the five, dropped in for an ace, and that's beautiful. Veronika Schlagowska, the 21-year-old in her first season with Zhezhov. Finding the hole. Just a cut angle. Look at that. Beautifully done from Maya Ogninovic. Third kick on. Sinead Jack out. They've been interchanging all night. It's a Tabashi serve. 
free ball for them. Power hits off the left side from Voronkova. She pumps her fists in the air, the Russian. Ogninovic off and Elif Sahin on for Tatsubashi. They lead by three in this third set. Picked up well. Blocked off the spike of Kalandadze. Confidence oozing out of every pore for Itatsubashi. Kalandadze really wound up on that as well. The blocking wall did a tremendous job. Served into the net. Zhezhov need to dig deep into the well of guts and intestinal fortitude to try and turn this set around. Abiala on serve. Cannot afford to miss it. It was only a quick stint for Sahin. Ogninovic back on for Etzatabashi. Akos with the reception. That was a hard to deal with ball. And it puts Zhezhov within two now. Oh, Abiala. Lovely positioning. It just rose and then suddenly dropped. It looked like the six and a lovely serve there from Obiala. Second time, if she's successful, she goes drop. Remember about this. So make sure that the block at left side is not good now. We can use. And at defense, there are long defenders. So you, if you are in trouble, you, you can keep. Right, let's go. Aye, 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 aye. Some of the Polish fans who have made the trip to Turkey trying to rally Zhezhov. 21-20, I told you it was going to be a close third set. It has proven that indeed. And Obiala on serve for Zhezhov. Down the center, picked up by Akos. Beautiful pancake save. Free ball, but ultimately goes wide. And Zhezhov have drawn even. Now the key to get ahead. That really was poor work there from Guvelli. Has the pendulum swung? From behind the attack line. And it's lovely. Boscovic. Tiana Boscovic. Soaring like a firework. Serve to the center. Beautifully, beautifully executed. Zhezhov back in rotation. This seesawing set continues. High fives all round from Zhezhov as Orvasova comes back on, replaces Julia Binchiska. Could that spell danger for Itatsubashi? Venerska on serve. Smashing, absolutely smashing from Tiana Boscovich. Left hand found a big gaping crater. Two points away from the set now. Voronkova serves. And again, Zhezhov pull it back.
Magdalena Jurczyk. 28 winning spikes in the campaign coming in tonight, and it gets Cullen Dunze on serve. Nail biting stuff here in Turkey. Cullen Dudze goes down the center. Arkos with the reception. The hit goes wide. There are complaints from Atatabashi, from Boscovic. Zhezhov with set point. Challenge. Well, the drama continues here inside the TVF Burhan Felix Sport Hall in Istanbul. This is a crucial decision we're about to hear and see. Set point indeed for Zhezhov. Kalandadze on serve. The block out. Now don't forget you must win the set by two points clear. And the block out coming off the hands of Jurcic. What drama. This is what they came to see. Orbis over. Right side hit. Gets the block out points off the hands of Hande Baladin. Magdalena Jurcic. Sinead Jack couldn't deal with that block. Has a spill. And look at that. Zhezhov take it. And the jubilation because history not repeating itself. As we said, first quarter final, they won the opening set. They lost the next three. They won the opening set tonight. They lost the second. But jubilation after winning the third.
79 minutes deep into this quarterfinal for the right to go through to the semi-final stage and Zhezhov lead two sets to one a 26-24 third set for the Polish away team and a failed serve in the opening point puts Itzatzabashi into rotation free ball there for Itzatzabashi wonderful reception Kalandadze with placement and Kalandadze delivers the first point in this set for Zhezhov beautiful little redirection there from Kalandadze she is on serve here the Georgian powerful serve into the one and a powerful hit there. Irina Vronkova, the Russian. Getting the block out. Are we going to see another nail-biter of a set? Magdalena Jurczyk has been impressive tonight. Sends it through the center. The hit came from Yasmin Kuveli. And indeed, she is on serve. Into the net goes Yasmin. And back in rotation goes Zhezhov. It is Gabriela Orbasova. Well picked up there from Arcos. Cross court. Arcos with the set. And a smash. Absolute smash from Boscovic. Tiana Boscovic. 66 winning spikes, six kill blocks and two aces coming in tonight. And Boscovich on serve for Etzatzabashi. Into the net from Boscovich. Tied at four all. Veronika Schlagowska who was named the best outside hitter at the under-20 Polish Championships four years ago. Free ball here, put up by Sinead Jack. Big hit off the right side. Wonderful from Obiala. Salia Sahin on, Baladin out for Edsatsabashi. Serve to the middle from behind the attack line. Beautiful work from the Libero Shligovska, but ultimately the point going the way of Edsatsabashi. We are locked at five all in this fourth set. Strap yourselves in, folks. I think we're in for another nail biter. If you've got any nails left, I don't blame you if you've chewed them down to next to nothing. Akos with a set. 
Lovely work again from Tiana Boscovic. Hitting off that right side. Sahin, who only just came on the court. Kept alive by Akos. Free ball here for Zhezhov. Powerful stuff from Anne Kaladadze. She is a superstar and she was never going to miss that one. Helen Dudze cuts a beautiful angle, trying to drive it through the court. Akos with the reception, Sinead Jack with a hit, and she grunts. Sinead Jack has had a wonderful night, particularly in that second set that and Tatsubashi won, she was blocking superbly, and she is on serve now. Block out. Akos with the reception. Cullen Dudze is just marshalling everything on that left side. Hard to deal with. Ball still in play. And out now. It was lovely work from Vorenkova on the left side. Ogninovic, Kalandadze with the reception. A little tip over. It's Adzabashi moving ahead, 9-8. Challenges being called here. And it looks like the point has gone the way of Zhezhov. It was called out. Zhezhov 9 8 and Kalan does it as sir. Sixth best server in the Champions League this season, Kalandadze. Well done by Vorenkova. Kalandadze, lovely pick. Zhezhov have some momentum. Can they maintain the momentum? Shlagovska soaring like an eagle. Cullen Dudze serves again. Power serve through the centre, but it goes long. Ten nine. The superstar Vorenkova to serve. And they've drawn level at Zatzabashi, 10 all in this fourth set. Good blocking from Yasmin Guveli. Borenkova stays on serve. 
Serve goes long. Some protestation from Vorenkova. She thought it was in. So another challenge here. And the ball is indeed in. It's an ace from Vorenkova. And Satsabashi go ahead, 11-10. Kalan Dadze with the hit. Can they save this? It's Satsabashi. Free ball for Zhezhov. Hit from the right side. The drama continues here in Istanbul. Yoshik. Oh, found the campfire, didn't she? 12-11. Classic Boscovic. Yasmin on serve. Another very tight set. Yasmin floats it to the six. Blocking wall does its job and does it well. They put up a fortress. And the horns are locked in Istanbul. 12 points apiece in this fourth set. On serve now, Gabriela Orbisova, the 22 year old Czech. Akos with the reception. The block out. Deserved high fives as Kalandadze just tries to settle her troops. Well done by Sinead Jack. And that hit down the right side. Putting Zhezhov back on serve. Wonderfully done from Anna Obiala. Slagovska. Kalan Dadze, there's the block again. Wonderful. Sinead Jack and Maya Ognjanovic. More blocks than a box of Lego. Ognjanovic did well and she knew it. Sahin. Oh, Sinead Jack, she can do no wrong. The blocking of Adatabashi moves him ahead by two points. Actually, it wasn't Sinead Jack on that occasion. It was Vorenkova. What a tandem they are. Zhezhov lead two sets to one. Here in the fourth set, a two-point lead for the home team at Tatabashi, Istanbul. A real sense of tension inside the TVF Burhan Felix Sport Hall. 
the second quarter final. Callan does it. The block again from Atatabashi. It has been the blocking game that has moved them ahead by three points. Borinkova and Sinead Jack doing wonderfully. Orbisova power hit. And that was lovely. That was exquisite. That was Irina Voronkova. <laughs> Through the arms of Venerska. A timeout called by Zhezhov. They must steady the ship. Right side out, right side, right spike. Okay, but we need to play further. Okay, block defense. Well, such drama, such tension. I look at the stars. Kalandadze for Zhezhov. Boskovic for Itatabashi. And that spike going wide from Gabriela Orbasova. You feel Orbasova should have done a lot better with that. Five points clear now. The home team. Kalandadze. Wins a point back for Zhezhov. Beautiful placement. That is exquisite. Maya Ogninovic with a perfectly placed ball to put Etatabashi back into rotation. Good kick on, Sinead Jack out. Crowd trying to rally behind it's Atabashi, who are five points in the lead. Lovely spike off the right side from Gabriela Orbasova. It is Katarzyna Venerska, the 29 year old on serve. Had eight aces coming in tonight, did Venerska. Well picked up by Akos. Block there from Kalandadze. Akos has hit 60% positive receptions through this campaign so far. The lady they call the Atamand. Arici on for Yasmin. Venerska. Akons with the reception. It's up here. Beautiful dig. Kalantadze tried to place it. Akos with the set. Boskovic with the hit. Callan does it. Off the blockers. From behind the baseline, or the attack line, I should say, Boscovich. And just tipped over. Lovely work from Voronkova. Five points away from this set. It's Atabashi.
Serve floated in. That one stays in. At a glance, it looked like it did go wide, and I think a challenge has been called here. And my glance was right. The ball is out. Maya Ognilovic to serve for a Tatsubashi. Four points away from winning the set. Lovely hit there from Jurcic. Very short set. Short spike. Callan Dudzi on serve. How they need her now. And Callan Dudzi. The block out point from Vorenkova. Irina Vorenkova has been a house on fire again for a Tatsubashi. And she is on serve. The towering Russian. Thunders it through the center. Kalantadze ran the pipe wonderfully. But ultimately, it's Tatsubashi. Now two points away from the set. Vorenkova stays on serve. Free ball there for Zhezhov. They stay within five. Orvisova getting the block out point. Serve was a little hard to deal with. So too that hit. Free ball here for Atatabashi. Boscovic shot the left hand. Placement, lovely, exquisite. And Tatsubashi have set point. Aritzia <laughs> Rasur. Turkish national team member since 2017. A must-win point for Zhezhov, and indeed they do win it. They stay alive in this fourth set. Vinciska on for Orvisova. Julia Vinciska. Only 20 years old. A lot of pressure on this serve. The ball kept alive. Hit from the right side. And Zhezhov to within four points of Itatsubashi. It is going to have to be a very special run to score the next four points for Zhezhov. Communicate between each other, okay? Rafaj 
left side is not so great block, she makes right hand block. In this side there is Shilagovska, really good blocking. Sometimes close your line, sometimes open left hand. Okay, Haydi Bambo, let's go. But Hatak Bas again highlighting Izzy Rapash as a possible chink in the armour of Zhezhov. Believes her blocking to not be on point. They trail by four in this fourth set, Zhezhov. They do lead two sets to one. Good block. From Sinead Jack. Three points in it now. Big scream and a little shimmy of a dance there from Veronika Schlagowska. Wonderful, absolutely wonderful. We are tied at two sets apiece. And this crowd giving it up for a Tatsabashi to defeat Istanbul. You could not have scripted this drama. For a place in the semi-finals, Julia Binchiska to serve for Zhezhov.
High fives from Akos, the Adam Ant, the superstar Libero for Etsatsubashi. Twenty-year-old Julia Binchiska to get us underway. Free ball for Atatsubashi. Wonderful strike. From Zhezhov, just playing it safely. It was a solid strike from Vonkova, but a nice block there from Zhezhov. They go 1 0 up. Vonkova, powerful off the left side. One hundred and eight minutes played so far in this thrilling quarterfinal match. Bezaritsia. It's a have been blocking so well all night. Good touch there from Sinead Jack. She has had a superb evening. And it keeps Aritzia on serve. Gold medalist at the Under-23 World Championships in 2017. Aritzia actually won the Best Middle Blocker Award. The hit there from Slagovska. Veronika Slagovska named the best outside here at the Under-20 Polish Championships four years ago. In her first season with Jeshoff, she's on serve. Jack makes a move and Jack makes a kill hit. Lovely work from Sinead Jack. That one goes wide for Magdalena Jurczyk. A mixed bag from Jurczyk tonight. And Ogninovic serves. Put up by Boscovic. There's the set. Tip over. Free ball here for Edsatsubashi. Sinead Jack with a hit goes long. Or does it? Came off, off fingers. Sinead Jack will be among the MVP votes tonight. Jack again. Hit from the right side. And a smashing hit from Bagrovska. Katrina Bagrovska, the 22 year old outside hitter. Jurczyk. Good vision there from Tatsubashi to realize the serve was going long. You saw Vorenkova just pull her hands away from the ball in time to let it sail past. Here is Irina Vorenkova. Power serve, but goes too far. Zhezhov. Trail by two in this fifth set.
a hush falls over the TVF Burhan Felix Sport Hall. There are not many fingernails left in this venue, folks, I'll tell you that. Sinead Jack, a wonderful hit. She got airborne with that one and lanced it over the net. Yaprak Ekek to serve. Beautiful ball. Lovely tip over there from Bezia Aritzia. Incredible drama. Who will go through to the semi finals? And Tatsubashi lead by three. Yaprak Erkek, the 21 year old outside hitter to serve. Good save. There's the set. There's the hit. And it works well. Tiana Boscovich again. That was a wonderful sliding save from Urkic. And the hit from Boscovich. Zhezhov back to within three points. The block out of the hit from Obiala. Jack in, Erkek off. A must win point here for Zhezhov. Powerful serve, met well by the Libero. And a Jachabashi. Four points clear. It's a beautiful reception from Akos. And Maya Ogninovic. Right place, right time. Elif Sahin comes on. The setter with five winning spikes in this campaign so far, Sahin. Free ball there for a Tatsubashi. And a hit down the line is successful for Salia Sahin. Eleven six now. Arad Tatsubashi on their way to the semi finals. Tiana Boscovich on third. They're almost there. But still the fans inside the TVF Burhan Felix Sport Hall not going to celebrate prematurely. A hush falls over the arena once more. The block out there. Well placed from Veronika Schlagowska. 12-7. Obiala serves to the centre, picked up by Akos. Blockout point scored again for Atatabashi. Akos, who was hitting 60% receptions coming in tonight, the Adamant has had another wonderful game. 
Well, how about this for a Tatsubashi? Is this the time? In this golden set. Is this the time? Is this the moment? Not yet. 14-8, Zhezhov stay alive. It is a long bridge to traverse for Zhezhov. Six match points in hand for Atatabashi. Is it going to happen now? It does happen now. And Tatsubashi, Dinner in Istanbul, celebrate. They are through to the semi-finals of the CEV Champions League. And it's that lady, it had to be that lady, Tiana Boscovich, with a final say. Through the pipe she goes, and Boscovich makes no doubt about it. What drama unfolded in Istanbul tonight. It took a golden set, 15-8 for Adatsabashi Dinovid Istanbul to defeat Developres Rezhov and make their way through to the semi-finals. Uh, congratulations. Uh, two sets was enough, but you won the game. But this is a proof that there is no easy game in this level. What do you want to say about the game? Um, we know coming into this game, it would have been much harder than when we played in their home. 
Um, we just needed to stay calm, no matter, the, because we were going to have ups and downs regardless. We stayed calm, we stayed together, and we were able to come out victorious. Uh, and uh, in the semi-final, you will play against Nora. Mm -hmm. How do you evaluate that tie? Um, we know it's going to be even harder than this one. Um, you know, I believe in my team, I believe in us. And if we continue to play like this, when there's good times and bad, I think we can become champion. Okay, thank you. Congratulations, you are in the semi-final of Champions League, but there is no easy game in this competition and today is a proof of that. How do you come up the game? First of all, we knew coming here today would have been a difficult game with a lot of ups and downs. Um, they played a lot harder than when we played in their hometown and we were able to stay together during this hard time and I am so proud of my team and I think we can do anything if we continue to play like this. Of course, Navarra is a really good team. It's one of the best teams in the world. It's going to be difficult, but I believe in my team. I believe in us, and if we continue to stay together in the good and bad times, it's possible we can be champions. Thank you. Tebrikler. Bugün iki set kazanmak yeterdi ama maçı da galip bitirerek yarışına doğru yükseldiniz. Siz bu seviyede artık olay karşılaştığını nasıl değerlendiriyorsunuz bu maçı? Kesinlikle dediğiniz gibi yani bu saatten sonra hani bittiği şekilde kolay bir maçımız olmayacak. Hani bütün maçlar final maçı olabilir. Bugün de açıkçası ya şimdi bu sette hani iki set seçtiğinde oyuncu kesinlikle gösteremedik. Bence daha çok bize yakın oyunlar. Bundan sonraki setse ortaya koymamız gerekiyor. Yani şampiyonluğu düşünürsek daha çok o şekilde oynamamız gerekiyor. O yüzden sahada daha fazla şey yapmak. Thank you.